Hey guys, I um, just wanted to show you this radio that I'm trying to fix. Uh, it's a Mark radio. Uh, I've got channel 1 set to the output of the first mixer, which is up the top. You can see the frequency is uh, about 16.6 megahertz, uh, which is precisely 2 megahertz above the uh, actual frequency being measured. So the oscillators are correct. Um, the first oscillator is definitely correct. The first oscillator is running at uh, 15, what is it, 15.6 and uh, that minus the input signal of 13.6 gives me a 2 megahertz um, output going into the first IF, uh, into the, sorry, into the second IF. So that's really good. The signal, you can see the oval modulation there, it is, which is the blue down the bottom. That is the input to the detector diode. It is very, very heavily modulated, which is causing this. This is the problem. This is the problem. The IF output going to the detector is too heavily modulated. That's why it's distorting. Now I'm going to switch it to the AM band. So this will be running at 841. But uh, just look at the difference in the signal. The, the second line down the bottom is very, very good. And when I tune a station, watch it. So you could you calm yourself back down. That view that you get, how does the view you get of the night sky from the ground compared to what you get when you're up there in space? The biggest difference is there is not an atmosphere to look through, so there's no twinkling of the star. There are all these pinpoints of light. It was not so easy to stargaze on the space station. We don't think you can see during AM, the IF output going to the detector diode is perfect. It's got a predominantly carry away with a little bit of AM modulation up the top. That's what it should do. Now I'll switch. Now I'll switch it to bring the second IF in at uh, 12 megahertz. Go back to AM. And you can see with the AM signal, there's just a little bit of modulation on the uh, 455 kilohertz carrier going into the detector diode but on uh, shockwave when the second uh, converter kicks in the huge over modulation thank you